There's a leather guy out here, and he just ran inside the safe room a moment ago. So if he runs inside again, I'm going to be able to show you guys the trap. So this is what it does. You close the doors, and then I pull the lever. What's going on, guys? I'm Intrinsic Vince here, and today we are back with episode two of Living in a Double Locker on Viper. And to start off this episode, we are going to be going to check the stair trap. We've only had the trap for about an hour or two, so I don't expect it to have that much loot, but I have saw a couple people fall inside of it, and it looks like only one person ended up dying inside of it. Uh, we got a full Mesoid set. Uh, which is honestly really rare. You don't normally see all the armor together like this. Uh, so we got speed boots. We got a looting sword. This guy was definitely a fan of Mezoid. We got some pots as well. So it's definitely going to help us with today's video. But other than that, if you watch my previous episode, I did not die yesterday. So I am very confused and very happy. I am currently 6-0 and o when it comes to kills and deaths, so if we could keep it up throughout this episode, that would be amazing. Uh, hopefully, we just won't die for the entire series, but every time I've really brought it up and said something about me not dying, I normally end up dying in like the next clip. So let me go ahead and clean out this trap, and we will try and get some PvP. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this trap because it's actually insane. We have both safe rooms on both sides. If I go ahead and press this lever, it closes both of the safe room doors. And then if I go ahead and pull this lever, it removes the safe room doors in the entire ground. So I can lock people in both safe rooms at the same time and pull the trap on them as well. There's a leather guy out here and he just ran inside the safe room a moment ago. So if he runs inside again, I'm going to be able to show you guys the trap. So this is what it does. You close the doors and then I pull the lever and I don't think that guy ended up dying. He survived. This guy has to have like an archer kit on or something. So we're going to run in here. We're going to kill him inside this area. Oh, okay. He had a donation. I just heard some of the stuff burn. I don't know how he survived with no pots and no pearls. Swirls is literally outside of my base right now. And I kind of want to fight him, but I also kind of want to trap him. He's going to run in, isn't he? Come on, run in, buddy. Go into my safe room. He knows it's a trap. I'm trying to get, dude, walk in, please. Is he in enough? I can't tell if he's in enough. Walk into the safe room, buddy. Oh, someone hit him in. Oh my God, I fell down. No way. We have swirls in it. Okay. Do I want to pull the lever? I need for him to come closer. Come on. Come on. I need to pull the lever so it falls. I pulled it. He fell. Okay, he's down there. He's probably not going to die. He definitely clutch pearled, didn't he? He did. He clutch pearled. Okay, this is not good. I should have just fought him inside the safe room. But now we're running inside. I'm inside with him. This is not good. I don't have a god apple or anything like that. Oh, I didn't even finish the, the wall. I didn't finish the wall of crafting tables. He could pot right now. This is not good. Well, well, at least he doesn't have a bard, but he is in a big faction. So he could have a bard like mine down. But we seem to be winning this so far. I cannot block hit because I'm going to click the crafting table. I just have to win by critting him out like this. But he does have partner package items, so that is not good for me. Dude, he is doing so much damage to me. Let's hit the Lambo Strambler. Oh my god, we're going to die. We are going to have our first death, I do believe. I just summoned the fence gate. Oh! Lambo Strambler! I scrambled his inventory! Holy crap, he's inside my base. And I have like no pots. This is not good whatsoever. We're fighting him inside my base now. He's doing so much damage to me, dude. Click the up sign. I click the up sign. Oh, he came up. Okay, this is not good. He can literally get outside of my base right now. Let's go ahead and close this off. So he can't get out. Make sure no one can drop him pots or anything. We're gonna fight him again. Oh, do that. Wait, I can get more pots. Okay, we're not totally screwed yet. He's inside with me. He, he hit me with a mesoid bone. Okay, come on. We're critting him out. Oh, he's taking so much damage. He's potting. Yes. I refilled a row of pots. We probably have around the same amount now. Dude, come on. He ate a crapple right there. So I should be losing. I can't get out anywhere because I have the mesoid bone on me, which makes, which makes you not be able to open fence gates, but it seems like it wore off. He's just running away from me now. Oh, trap him in this area. He's trying to go down. I killed him. Holy crap, we killed Swirls, and he had a lot of partner package items on him. 
and he also he had a mesoid set so we ended up killing swirls we got his entire set and i even got his head i'm probably going to put that outside of our base uh, let's just go ahead and put all the partner package items inside of this chest. Let's go ahead and go outside and show off to everyone that we killed Swirls. I just need to get a bunch of YouTubers heads right here. Where is that guy going? I need someone to run into my base. I want to try and do the trap. There's a bard over there. What is he doing? There's people that always like run around my base, but they never just run into my freaking safe room anymore. I've literally like just been killing everyone, I guess. Oh, these guys might run in. Pearl? Oh my, he's, he's brick walling me away. Okay, this is not good. We're gonna run. Oh my gosh, I'm on cooldown. We do not need to run inside of our trap. Oh. That guy just tried to snowball me into that trap. Oh, we're inside. You wanna chase me in now? Come on, buddy. I will literally snowball you. Come closer. Or snowball me, honestly. Oh, I closed him in. No way. Dude, I have to. No, no. This is not good. I have to wait for my cooldown to go off. He's standing in the other safe room. This bard is fighting me. Yo, buddy, don't you want your diamond to fight? Dude, this is not good. I have him trapped inside the base. Oh, I got inside. No. Okay, the diamond. The, the other one's inside of my base now. Okay, let's close that. All right. Let's trap him. He's dead. Or at least he's down at the bottom. Okay, we're going to fight him now. His bards are to mine down. This is not good. I have to kill him before his bard mines down. It's lagging. What is going on? The server just crashed. Are you kidding me? I just trapped this guy. I was waiting for so long for someone to run inside of my base and I finally trapped someone and the server crashes. I'm not even joking. I was waiting for like two to three hours for someone to run over to my base. I finally get them trapped and the server crashes. Literally jet ski just ran straight into the safe room. Um, okay, let's close it. And uh, well, let's trap you. <laughs> okay, we're going down. Is he gonna die? He died of fall damage. No way. Well, we just got a full loadout and hopefully a very good set. We got speed two boots. That's all we needed. <gasps> oh my god. I literally just mined straight into their base. No way. Oh, I killed one. He's on 1DTR. Holy crap, I literally got him from the nether portal. They're on 1DTR right now. Where's his teammate? Oh, I'm trapped. Okay, that's not good. I need to F stock, come back down, and I can get in their base again. This is literally the, this is literally the first base I was running to today, and I just mined straight in because of their nether portal. It was right beside wilderness. I just have stopped, and the guy is messaging me, how did you get into my base? Okay, where's the hole? I doubt he's going to F home because he knows I'm inside his base, but I want to get back down there and see if I can find out what that guy had exactly, because I clicked the up sign so fast. Oh my god. I almost just died. That could have been really bad, but I literally just mined over in this direction, and the base was wide open, and all the stuff despawned. Well, I made him one DTR. No way. This is the guy I was going for. He's in an iron set outside of his base. Oh, no. He's going to get safe. His F home is right to the left. Oh, he just, he just stood still. Oh, my God. He ran into a cactus. Well, this is the base. They have a sand trap that's pulled. I'm going to go ahead and go down here. Is there? Oh, I thought there was going to be a way into their base. Okay, I might as well just have home. I wonder if this guy will let... Oh my gosh, he's gonna let me in his base. He is he is literally on one DTR. He's potting up a speed. Let me in. I'll hit him with the bone. Let's do it. Wait. Hit him with the bone? I did it. He can't place blocks. I should be winning this fight. I killed him. What? What? The kid's literally raidable. What is he doing? I just got a full prot 2 set. He had no pots on him. He's back online. Yo, what? Did did he not realize he was 1DTR? Um, I'm able to take all of his stuff now. Uh, whoa, he had a lot of stuff here. Okay, oh, he's, I mean, I'll take the kill. I'll take the free kills. Keep coming online, buddy. What did he have here? He had books. Dude, what? He had speed 2 books, but he didn't put it on his boots. Um, okay, let's turn and try and what? Okay. <laughs> I put the speed tube book on the boots and it destroyed the boots. 
Maybe he knows something uh, I don't. Uh, well, at least I have one more speed tube book. Um, I'll take the Hellforge as well, the fire resistance. I could take the cobwebs, honestly. Dude, how many lives do you have? I'm just trying to go ahead and assume that he did not know he was on one DTR. And he didn't even have water at the bottom. I just realized that. Well, okay. Guess I'm gonna go ahead and F home now. Wait, I was literally F homing? And I just saw a lightning bolt like of someone dying of fall damage. Did someone actually just jump down there thinking there was water? This guy just died. He did. <laughs> this guy literally came over to try and steal my raid, but he didn't realize there was no... Who is that? Okay, we gotta go. Okay, that guy realized there wasn't water at the bottom. Literally a random faction came over, tried to steal my raid, and one of them ended up dying of fall damage. That guy's a solo. Who are those people chasing me? Are you joking? I just have homed and the same guy that was at the base trying to steal my raid is at my base now. No way. I'm running. Wait, there. What? Hold on. I'll, I'll bring you guys back to that in just a moment. Did someone just jump down here with no armor? He hit the ground too hard. But, uh, but what I was trying to say is I literally just did living in invents of Among Us. And uh, I just found someone else doing it. So shout out to these guys. What? No way. I literally just got here and these people just stole the raid. They just made them raidable. Well, I guess I can go over here and uh, I'll just go in and get a kill as well. I am not going down there though because there's two diamond guys at least. Well, to be honest, I think that is a good way to end off this episode. I was going to want to try and trap some more people inside of the base, but there's really just no one out there. It's currently 4 a.m., uh, and I'll probably get some trap clips in my next episode. At least that's what I'm planning on doing. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to hit the like button, click the subscribe button, and I have a little bit of a secret for you guys. I don't think I've said anything about this. I am going to be doing a vlog, and I'm actually posting it this Wednesday. Uh, so today is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. That is when the video will be posted. And then obviously my HGF video will be after that on Thursday. But I just wanted to let you guys in on that little bit of a secret if you guys watch this video. Uh, and I probably talked about this video inside of the vlog because I'm about to, you know, I'm about to end this video off so I can go record some more of that and then go to sleep because like I said, it's 4 a.m. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys are going to enjoy the vlog, and I hope you have enjoyed my channel. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.